This video introduces the functions of the XDelphi software from a facilitator's perspective. The focus is on an open project addressing the future of the Delphi method, or in Delphi terms, a panel, which can be accessed via the provided URL link or a QR code. Before watching this video, it's recommended to view another video about the same survey, which examines the project from a panelist's perspective. The future of the Delphi method is addressed in XDelphi as its own project, which includes two sessions or queries. At the project level, the Delphi manager or project facilitator describes the project and creates its surveys. They also define the panel members and categorize them according to their expertise and stakeholder status. Other definitions are possible, but those features are related to the method's use in live situations and are presented in their own video. Panel members can be facilitators, panelists, or AI bots. Panelists are always anonymous, even when they are invited through a recognized email address. The facilitator has the option to categorize panelists in an expertise matrix, which allows for group-based examination and analysis of the data. When moving from the project level to the session or query level, the view changes. A functional icon row appears in the top left of the screen, with either Edit, Facilitate, or Analyze mode active. The following screen will activate the Edit mode. The query's individual questions or info slides, called Canvases in XDelphi, are visible on the left side of the screen. The query's homepage is active, but its content is only visible in edit mode. On the right side of the screen are the content definitions for each canvas, and above it, the query's default state. In the current situation, the panel is active, meaning panelists can participate in it. The arrow indicates moving into edit mode. When entering edit mode, the content of the first canvas can be modified. The homepage canvas consists of two screen sections, one with text and the other with an image. On the right side, both the session or survey and the individual canvas properties are defined. The parameters of the survey under examination are general, interaction, and look. Let's jump to the next, the first actual question, which is of a two-dimensional form. The question view consists of a title, a text-based question, and a response distribution matrix. In the matrix, the current responses are shown as gray circles, along with their median, as well as the upper and lower quartiles, depicted by colored dots. To edit a question, it is important to remember to save, publish button, the changes. Questions have several definition tabs, general, interaction, look, data, stats. The data tab and its selected parameters are shown in the image. The same question can be presented in both matrix and slider formats. Statistical averages are chosen on their own stats tab. Often in Delphi's, the same question type is preferred throughout the query, and that is done here as well. It speeds up query creation when questions are cloned and only text parts are changed. Question duplication occurs by right-clicking on the canvas icon. Next, we move to the Facilitate, and soon after, to the Analyze mode. Its use is activated when the Delphi process is underway and the panel begins to accumulate data. Each question structure is observed on the Navigate tab, which also allows for movement in hierarchical discussions. Accumulated data can be segmented using the Filter function. There are other segmentation variables besides expertise grouping. The facilitator can, for example, tag or otherwise mark comment data in any desired way. On the analysis side, there are four AI-assisted functions utilizing the generative language model. In addition to summaries, a sentiment analysis, monitoring emotional data, and a list of what is currently missing from the argumentation are provided. Data can be exported either by query or question, in text or table format for further analysis. Finally, a brief description of the four-stage process by which a panelist is invited to participate in the panel. In addition to a personal invitation, the panelist can be guided to an open panel via a direct link or QR code. In this case, 
Each participation is unique. The last image shows the form in which the invitation arrives in the panelist's email. A separate video is produced focusing on creating the project, i.e., the panel, and its sessions or queries from the beginning.